happy high holy weekend, don't you know? I am here in the middle of the short parade. Uh, I'm gonna turn it around so you can see. It's about an hour before it starts and everybody's getting their trucks and their floats ready. I love the fact that these people think ahead or experienced float riders because they've got their Johnny on the spot right with them. <laughs> dedicated to Jimmy Buffett. There's a banner on the front that says it's five o'clock somewhere. It's a big float. It looks like a pontoon boat, actually. It says it's the Shelltown Shamrock. Of course, Snow Parade is complete without a marching band. South Park High School marching band coming at us. It's quite a band. And the drums, you can't do without the drums, you know. No idea. There's no sign on this truck. I love the balloons. <laughs> And somebody down here is Danny Boy playing. Sounds like it's on the steel workers float. But come ye back when summer's in the meadow. Okay, we're coming to some floats that are particularly attractive. No idea who they're for. Like a con and his pot of gold. And then down here is a great one. An Irish buffalo, don't you know? The Casey Leonard and Andula clan. So I'm inside the Valley Community Center and they are the people. Hey, how are you? They are the people who sponsor this parade. And I just have to show you these donuts. <laughs> Look at these. Oh my God. Does it get any better? So I'm not exactly sure, but I think I've found Buffalo Zone Leprechaun. What's your name? Dennis Leonard. Dennis, how long have you been dressing up like your Buffalo Zone Leprechaun? Every one of these four four parades. Seriously. Yes. Why do you do it? For the fun. And we're Irish. <laughs> And we're Irish. Well, <laughs> may the balance of the day be yours, young man. It's the same to you. <laughs> so I am here on the Valley Bus, which comes from the Valley Community Center, and I'm with today's driver and his special assistant. So tell me your names. My name is Donald Rogers. And you are? Ava Quinn. Ava Quinn. What a beautiful name. So Donald, tell me a little bit about you and your history with the Valley Association and why you're driving the bus today. Uh, I've been living in the First Ward for 22 years, from 55 till 77. Just volunteered my services at the Valley Community Center since then, and now I've been living in uh, the Valley area, the Valley Community. I'm on the Neighborhood Watch Committee, and um, I've been living down here since 77. Well, tell me how many uh, Valley parades you've seen in your time. Every one of them. Since when? When did they start? Oh, geez, just the 25th. What's special about this parade? Oh, it means everything. It just chips everybody up, makes everybody perk up, get ready for springtime. Gives them a li little release of all the pressures of wintertime and the dullness of winter. Plus, so, it gets everybody together, too. So. so we have two parades. This is the first. There's another one tomorrow, the Big St. Cat's Parade. Yes. What's the difference between the two of these? Well, th this one down here is more neighborhood-bound, more South Belt Flow, First Ward and all that. What does St. Patrick's Day mean to you? Everything. It's, it's uh, my it's my number one holiday. And how will you celebrate tomorrow? Tomorrow I'll sit around getting fat, eating corned beef and cabbage and potatoes and carrots, and just sitting with the family and talking.